Hi, my name is Kevin and I'm a product manager at Split. Today, I'd like to walk you through how to configure our new JIRA integration to connect and view feature flag and JIRA issue details in both platforms. By linking feature flags to issues, engineering and product teams can stay up to date on project and release statuses without having to toggle between tools or verify with the owner. It's gonna allow for seamless cross-team coordination throughout the feature lifecycle. Now, to set up the integration, you'll need admin access to both platforms. The integration is going to start out in Split, where we'll log into our integration settings in the admin settings and jump to our JIRA Cloud integration setup. Here, I'll plug in a workspace and the environment that I want to connect. And then Split will generate a API token that I will paste into JIRA later on. From there, I can hit Save, and that's all I need to do on the Split side. Now we'll jump over to the Atlassian Marketplace. And here I'll navigate to the Split for Jira page. And here I just need to click Get It Now and select a site to install it into and hit Install App. As soon as I've done that, I can now jump into Jira and looking at our connected app settings, I'll come to the Configure Split for Jira page. And here I'm going to just paste in that API key that I had grabbed from Split earlier and save that down. Once I've done that, integration setup is fully complete and we can now start linking the two systems together. So if I come over to a JIRA task that I have here called build out new great feature, we can see that on the far right, there's a releases section where I can add a feature flag to be associated to this JIRA task. I can hit create feature flag here. And so bring me into split where I can select a workspace and name my new feature release. Throw out some other details. <clears throat> and you can see at the bottom here that the JIRA issue is already connected to this new split. So I can go ahead and hit create. And as soon as I've done that, we can see that if I click over here to the additional settings, that the JIRA task has already been fully associated to this split. And we can actually see that the assignee, myself, and the status of the JIRA task have been populated here on the split side. Now, if I jump back over to the JIRA task, we can see that the new feature release split has been associated to here. And if I click in, we can see some extra details about the feature flag here in JIRA as well. Mm -hmm. Now, if I click over to new feature release, we can come back over here and say, I'm ready to change that rollout plan. I can just hit add rules, change that percentage here, say, let's roll this out to 10% of our users. I can go ahead and save those changes, confirm them down. And now that change has been saved, if I go back over to our JIRA task, we'll be able to see that the feature flag status has been changed to on and that the raw detail has been set to 90% off. So now with this integration configured, your teams can safely charge at full speed from develop and deploy to target and release without, while you're still using the tools that you're already accustomed to. Hope you found this demo helpful. For more detailed step-by-step -step guide on how to get started on integration, check out our tutorial. And you can also go to our integration page at split.io. Thanks all.